Hi, my name is Mark. I'm with the Stewart Rental Company, and today we're going to be showing you how to hook up our portable PA system. Um, it's a very simple system, um, and this is the amp. Most cases, when we send this out, it is in a cabinet, but for convenience for the video, we have it sitting on a tabletop. Um, it has six channels to hook up six microphones, and if you see right here in the front, you have your six channels. Channel one, channel two, channel three, four, five, and six. Uh, for channel one, you have your volume. It's uh, the last one at the bottom. And then right above it, you have your lows, your mids, and your highs. These are sets that you can preset till you get the microphone exactly like you want it to sound. And if you're gonna hook up a second one, same thing, so forth and so on. Over here to the right is our main EQ that you can set after you preset all the mics. This controls everything as a whole. Your main volume is going to be right here, right below the main EQ. And then you have your monitor volume if you use monitors, but we're not that high tech. We only run basic speakers. And then you have your effects over here. Uh, alongside the back of the unit, I'm going to turn it around. We have our power cord here, just take standard 110. Your on and off switch is right here, and right below us so we have all of our speaker hookups. These are where we hook our speakers into. We send our uh, PA system with two speakers. You can request up to four, but the standard is two. And they come with these tripod speaker stands, which they're very lightweight, which is very simple to uh, open up and lock into place. Very simple method. Once you get your speaker stand set up, the speakers go right on top portable speaker. At the bottom of the speaker there's a hole to set on the uh, stand and you just elevate that and you insert it right inside like that and you can adjust these to whatever direction you need them to go in then right underneath at the bottom of the speaker there is a uh, safety that you can tighten the speaker up to lock it into place. Now we're going to show you how to hook up the speakers to the PA system. I'm going to turn the speaker around if you notice on back of the speaker, there's two jacks for your speaker cable. Just takes a regular three quarter inch. I'm going to go ahead and plug this in to either side. I'm going to turn that back around. And then the other end goes in back of the PA system. I'm going to turn that around again. And I showed you previously the uh, speaker jacks right here. Doesn't matter which one you plug them into. Just plug it right into the number one. And we're going to power the PA system on. App is now powered up. We have our microphones that we offer. We offer two different types of microphones. One is a wired microphone, the other one is a wireless microphone. First we're going to be taking a look at our wired microphone. Let me show you the settings on that. This is a very standard wired microphone. It has an on and off switch which is located right here. That's on and that's off. And it comes with the um, wire already attached to it. On the PA system you want to make sure that your volumes are all the way down. So I'm going to go into channel 1 first. So I have the volume down and my main volume all the way to the right it's all the way down. We're going to insert the microphone into channel 1. Main volume. We're going to turn that up to about a 4. You can always adjust it later. Volume for mic number 1. We're going to speak slowly as we turn the volume up. Testing one, two, testing one, two, testing one, two. So we have power. Next we're going to hook up our wireless microphone, but first we're going to show you the components. First we have our microphone, we have our base unit, our microphone cable, and our power source for our base unit. It takes regular 110. I'm going to pick up the base unit and turn it around so you can see the back of it. The power cord goes right here in the back, fits in snugly. And then we're going to take our microphone cable and also plug it in. It fits snugly into here. Those are connected. Now we're going to show you how to hook up the base unit to the PA system. Now we're going to hook the wireless microphone to the PA system. We're going to take the power cord and plug it into regular 110. As soon as you plug in the base unit, it automatically comes on. There's no on and off switch and you know that by you see the numbers on front of the unit 
And now we're going to plug in the mic cord, which the one end is plugged into the back of the bass unit. Make sure your volumes are all the way down on channel one. We're going to plug that in to channel one. We're going to raise our main volume up to about four. We can always adjust it later. Now we're going to sync the cordless microphone to the bass unit. And the way we do that is we're going to turn the microphone upside down. We're going to unscrew the bottom. As you see, we have our batteries in place. We have our mute button. So we're going to hold this mute button in until the light comes on. See the light, indicator light is on. Now we're going to sync the wireless microphone to the base unit. By doing that, we're going to put the microphone right lined up with the base unit. There's a sync button. We're going to push on the base unit. The light comes on. The light goes off. The microphone is now synced. We're going to take this and put the bottom of the microphone back on. We're going to raise our main volume up to about a four. We can always adjust that later. And as we speak, we're going to slowly raise the volume up on channel one. Testing one, two. Testing one, two. And we have power. Also, if you would like to hook up an iPod, we do have iPod adapters available for our PA system. And this is a very simple hookup. You have your standard three-quarter inch plugs. We do send it with an adapter. Most iPods, it comes with the smaller prong and you just attach the adapter to one end. The other end goes right into the PA system and you can plug the other end right into your iPod. We hope this tutorial has been helpful for you. We at the Stuart Rental Company hope you have a great event.